there was a happy family who loves at each other. They are known as the Smith family and a wealthy family. This little girl named Riley Smith, age nine years old, species wolf, alpha, and half devil. She's the elder and this is Rue Smith, age eight years old, species alpha, wolf the youngest. The mother, name Rachel Smith, age 29, species alpha, Wolf. The father, name Richard Smith, age 30 years old, species Wolf, Devil. But one day, something unexpected happened. Rachel find out that the girl named Delilah is pregnant with her husband. What will she gonna do? Let's see on the story. Richard, you are the father of my child. What are you talking about? Do you remember the time that you're drunk last night? I know that, but I never see your face last night. All I see are my friends on my company, nothing else. But I'm telling the truth, Richard. No, this can't be happen. I already have a family. So what are we going to do? Are you going to tell this to your wife? I don't know either. Maybe we can keep this as a secret. Well, that secret won't last long. <laughs> Pregnant, huh? Congratulations. Hun. Oh, please, stop calling me hun. It's disgusting. I already heard everything after all the many years we have been together. I've suffered for nine months and more for our children. And this is what you're going to repay me. What kind of husband are you? Hun, you don't understand. I didn't even know how did this happen to her. Enough. You're the worst husband ever. You guys are really suited at each other. I hope you guys will get along. Hun, <laughs> let's talk about this. Why is mom crying? Probably something bad happened. Rachel, wait. Hun, open the door, please. We can fix this. Just please listen to me. But I'm telling the truth. I don't know how did Dalila get pregnant. Please open the door, Rachel. Dad, what do you mean that Delilah is pregnant with you? Un. Oh, honey, you have heard it right. I'm pregnant with your father. No, that can't be true. Dad won't do that. He loves Mom so much. He won't cheat on her. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, honey but your dad cheated. Maybe your dad don't love your mom anymore. Delilah, why did you say that? I'm just telling the truth, and of course they deserve to know. So you cheated on mom, huh dad? Why did you do that? I thought you only love her. Why did you do this to us? Have you forget your promise to mom that you won't cheat on her? But what happened? You broke the promise. Really it's an unexpected happen. All I know is I'm drunk last night. Please really listen to me. Enough is enough. You are the most bad dad ever. I hate you. Richard, are you okay? I don't know how I can forgive myself. I'm such a bad father. H, hey, calm down. It's not your fault. It's my fault. If I wasn't on the bar last night, this couldn't be happen. No, don't blame yourself because it's my fault. I shouldn't drink a lot last night. By the way, Richard, today is midnight. Can I ask where should I sleep? There is another room for you to sleep. My maid will tell you where it is. Okay, but what about our child? What are we going to do, Richard? Give me some time to think, Delilah, and I'll tell the maid to get your bed ready. Give me some space to think of this situation. Later at night. Goodbye, my little angels. I love you too very much. And I'm sorry that mom is going to leave you guys. It doesn't mean I don't love you guys. It's just that I can't raise you to my little angels because mom is too poor. 
Your dad will take good care of you too. But don't worry, mom will come back soon. And mom, why are you crying? Oh, this is nothing, my angel. But I want you to promise me something. That when I'm not by your side, please take good care of yourself and your sister and your dad. Why are you saying like that, mom? You're not going to leave us, right? Of course, mom won't leave you. Now, go back to sleep. Okay, mom. Good night. Good night. Goodbye. In the morning. Sis, can you repeat it again? Because I forgot. Sis, are you even listening? Rue, do you know where's your mom is? No, I don't know where she is. Are you too mad at me because of what happened yesterday? Is there a children will be happy if their father cheated? No, right? You don't even think how we feel when you cheated. Is that what you call a father? You cheated on mom, even though you already have us. Oh, really? I already told you that I don't know how did that happen to Delilah. Please believe me, really. So? You are telling me that you didn't cheat? Then how can you tell me that Delila know that you were the father of her baby? Can't say anything, huh, Dad? Then, I take it as a yes that you really cheated on Mom. I have something to tell you, Dad. To be honest, Mom showed up at night on our room. She has said something to me. That, when she is not on my side, I should take good care of myself and my sister and you. And yes, I noticed that she is wearing a jacket and she looked like she's going somewhere. That means she leave us. No, your mom won't do that. She love you too so much. She looks like she's leaving. Mom even tears and look at me sad at that night. I asked her why, but she said it was nothing. It's definitely obvious, right? She will leave because mom don't want to live with a cheater and a mistress. Really? I really hate you, dad, more than anything else. Are you happy now, dad? You definitely made mom leave and made really cry. Is this what you wanted? You should smile now. The girl that you don't love have already leave. To be honest, I don't want to have a step-sibling from your mistress. Just think about it, dad. The thing that you have done is very wrong, and it ruins our family. You are really a good father, huh? Richard. What happened? Why did Rue leave? Two months later still, Richard didn't find Rachel. What are you doing here, Delilah? I just want to visit my lovely future husband. Why are you acting like my wife, and that future won't happen? I didn't even know how did this happen to you and I didn't saw you on the bar few months ago. I know I'm the father of all your child but this situation made me uncomfortable, so please stop acting so clingy to me Delilah. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable Richard, and I really love you Richard. What about you? Do you love me? I'm sorry Delilah, but I don't love you. It's fine, I will try my best for you to gain a feelings for me. I have to go now Delilah. I have a meeting today. Take care, Richard. Really, what are you doing here? I was just looking for Rue. Really, are you still mad at me? If you really can't forgive me, really. Please tell me what you want. I will do everything for you just to forgive me. And that the time Riley never want to talk to her father. She won't forgive him whatever her father Richard would do. Of course, Rayu didn't forgive Richard. Both of Richard's children hate him. Seven months later, Delilah gave birth. Are you okay and the baby? Yes, I'm fine and the baby too. She is very healthy. I'm glad to hear that. Can I hold her for a sec? Yes, you can. Really, you have a new sister. She's not my sister. She is my stepsister only. I know but she's still your little sister. Yeah, yeah, whatever. 
So what are we going to name her? Hmm. Let's name her Azela. What a pretty name, Azela. Sis, why did you leave? It's because I don't want to see their lovey, lovely Davy talking, just like you. Dad was like, "What a pretty name! Are you okay, Delila? God, he is so dramatic." And also, Delila, she was like, "Can you give me a hug, Richard?" So yuck! And Dad said, "Why? Okay." It says you should stop because your voice is too loud. We are on the hospital, remember? So what? I'm just talking here. You are not talking. You're yelling. I'm not. Please stop. We are on the hospital. You don't want to get kicked out, right? Ugh. Fine. Gosh, you're so noisy. By the way, you were right. They are really dramatic. Delila even said, "I love you to Dad." Really? That girl, Delila. Is this stop? It was just a joke, lying. What do you mean joke? You literally said it in your own mouth, bro. Now, let go of me. I'll have something to talk to that bullshit, Delila. Where did you learn to speak a bad word, sis? No one teaches that. I don't know. Probably I heard it somewhere. So let go of me now. That Delila need to taste her own medicine. No, I won't let you get on trouble. Dad would be mad. I don't care. I will make that girl regrets of saying that words to our father. No, you can't get away with this. I need to teach that Delila a lesson. No, you can't go. You want some battle, huh, bro? Is that your kid's voice? Maybe. Two years later. Smile. One, two. Sis, why did you leave the family photo taking again? I just don't want to have a family photo taking with them, Ru. Why? Yeah. Why? You have been like this really since Azella came. Do you hate Azella? You never join our family photo. Especially you, Ru. You didn't join us today for the first time. What's the matter? Do you hate Azella too? Um, no, it's just. Did I tell you that Azella is the reason why I won't join the family photo, Dad? Did I? No, but you have been like this really since she came. So you don't like it? Family photo is not so important, Dad, and also it's just a picture. Dot dot. So don't be so upset with it that I didn't join the family photo. Then, tell me the reason why you won't join us. You wanna know? Because I don't like it. I hate it. Pardon? I hate getting a family photo with a stepmother and stepsister because I'm not part of that family. It's just you and Dalila and Azila should take a family photo. Ru joined because he wanted to or something else. I don't know, but for me, I don't want it. See, you hate them. I hate them. I just don't like it because mom isn't here. How could I join to that family photo that the woman there is not my real mother? That's not a real family photo, dad. Since when you gonna find mom, dad? When we gonna turn into a teenager? How many years I'm gonna wait, dad? I've been always think about mom. If she is okay, and maybe something bad happen or anything else. I, I, I don't know really. I'm sorry. I keep finding her since she run away, but still I can't find her. See, you can't even find her. Now you know why I don't want a family photo. Me either, Dad. I didn't join today because mom isn't there, and also sister Riley. We're not complete. It's just very hurt that we take a family photo without the person that we love the most. Really, stop crying. I'm sorry. Sis, wait. Mama, let's play. Mama, mama, mama. I'll talk to you later. What do you want now, Azila? Why did you ignore me? I'm on the phone, Azila. Now tell me what do you want. I don't have much time. Can we play together? I'm sorry, Azila. Go play with your step siblings. I'm busy. You are always busy, Mom. Because I'm busy, of course. Now go to your step siblings. But they won't play with me. They don't like me. Well, that's your problem.
Well, that was fun. Are you feeling better now, sis? I'm feeling dizzy, Roo, and I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Probably you eat a lot of food, sis. Hi, stepbrother and stepsister. What do you want? I wasn't gonna ask you guys about this if mom agree with me, but she did in single quotes t dot dot s o can I play with you guys? Your mom won't play with you? Why, yes. Ha ha. You are so unlucky to have a mother like her. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. She can't even play with you or taking good care of you. You always get shouted by her. Am I right? You are right. But she can still change, right? Maybe mom was just on a bad mood. That's why she always treating me like this. How can she be on a bad mood, Azila? She has a bad personality, dramatic. Doesn't care how the person feels except dad. Stop, you're trying to make me hate my mother. Am I? Yes, you're saying many bad things about mom. Why do you hate her that much? And also, Dad, you always argue with each other. Always? Girl, we argue once, twice, or sometimes. Right, Ro? I don't know. I didn't count. I think Azila was right, H E He. See? Even stepbrother agree with me. So what? I can hate them whatever I want. I'm asking why you hate them. Because I hate them. Why are you asking so many questions? Soft hearted, huh? It's a very long story, Azila. There are so many reasons why I hate your mom and dad. A and. And stop crying. Don't be such a crybaby. Sis, be more nice to her. You talked to her hurtly even though she didn't do wrong. So you are on her side? Boom. You know what? You are really pretty, so don't cry or else that face of yours will be ruined. Got it? H, huh? I'm sorry, Azila. I really hurt you by my words and how I act. I just really hate them for many reasons. But I'm really confused. Why did you cry immediately? It's because you shout at her, sis. I'm not asking you, bro. Step brother Ru is right. You shout at me loudly, and you are so mad, even though I didn't do wrong. Told ya. How about let's play, okay? Let's forget what happened today and all the things have happened before. Okay. See your face fix because you stop crying. Never reminded. Never taking whatever you told me. I know what I could be. Are you okay now, Azila? I guess so. Your mom really don't have a heart. She doesn't care how you feel. It's okay, stepsister Riley. I'm already used to it. Oh, you're already home, Dad. After two months of trip. Yes. Do you need something? I have a question about Azila. Did something happen? Nothing happened. I just want to know that why Azila's eyes are purple. Her eyes are not the same of you and Delila. So why? I don't know. I will ask Delila. Maybe she know why. Don't worry. I'll be fast. Just wait here for a moment. Delila. Richard, welcome back. I have a question. What is it? Why is Eli color is not the same of you and me? Oh, that as she has the same eye color to my grandma. I'm sorry I didn't tell you this before. It's fine. I gotta go. That's really new. Really? What did she say? She said that the eye color of Azella is just the same as her grandma. Huh? You don't have to worry. I don't believe it. She's probably lying. Delila won't lie, really. <laughs> Then prove it by doing a DNA test. That's look like you want to know if I'm really the father of Azella. Yes, and we start it tomorrow morning. And by the way, let's keep it a secret. Only you and me know about this, Dad. Do you agree? Okay. Tomorrow morning. It can't be Azella is not my real daughter. She has a species of demon just like me. Delila won't lie. Richard. Oh, hi Delila. Why are you calling me? I really want to buy something important. Sue, can you give me some of your money? Okay, here you go. Thank you, Richard. I got the hair of Azila. Ru will watch her, and I already told Ru that we will come back in minutes. 
Then let's go.